Hi everyone. Today we are looking at Unreal Engine 5. They have re released a test version, alpha version, whatever you want to call it. They have released it and they're letting us play with it. I got a little scene going on here that is testing the lumen, the um, global illumination and the, uh, the real-time reflections. Um, and it's, I have to say, it's pretty awesome. Although it is pretty hardware intensive. Um, well, on my hardware, uh, I think I'm only running, let's see, what am I running? Not too bad. Uh, 50 frames, 45. So in between 45 and 50 frames. Um, second, in this scene, uh, I've done a little bit of some optimizations and stuff like that. I was getting only 30, um, but now I'm getting between 45 and 50 frames per second. I could probably do some more stuff to make it a little bit better, um, but Unreal Engine 5, I think, uh, it's going to be a game changer in a lot of ways. Um, this Lumen system, awesome. I am really loving it so far. Um, I'm just hoping that it will be cool and feasible games and it will just keep on getting better. Let me go ahead and uh, go in game. So when I full screen it, it only runs around 30 frames per second. Um, I don't have very much in this scene. I just have this. So you just got to keep that in mind. I got a sort of kind of beefy computer too, so it's a little surprising. Um, anyways. Go ahead and pause that and I will turn on desktop audio real quick. Come back in there. And these reflections, beautiful. I mean, you could achieve this quality by baking the lighting and stuff like this. I've always been able to achieve this lighting instead of 3, 4 and reflections and stuff, but for this being real time, it's just amazing. I probably don't have everything set up correctly because uh, I haven't really watched too much on it. Um, and just going off kind of a feel for things. But yeah. So I'm going to upload this scene to GitHub. Um, and anybody who wants it will be able to download it for free if you guys want it. Uh, that's what I was kind of making the video to show off Lumen a little bit. And, uh,. I'm going to go ahead and give you guys the scene if you guys want it. Uh, it's not it's not a very big scene. Let me uh, go to unlit mode and show you guys. Oh, that's all there is to it. Just got a little, little bit of geometry here and there. Um, some rain. Good rain particle effect. Uh, and show you how to do it in Niagara if you want the on it, back to lit. Show it off one more time. Now we are getting a little bit of flickering some spots uh, but I believe if we go in here um, I'll go in here and I'll show you guys so if we go to the post process volume 
uh, and we scroll down to global illumination I got it set on lumen right now we got the screen space is, is beta uh, and then ray traced so we got lumen now this one it scales uh, the gather quality larger scale uh, reduces noise but greatly increases the GPU cost so this was I think by default on one I just raised it up to two um, for for now it, it makes it look pretty good um, we could probably raise this up to three or four I'm not too sure go up to four see how much more it dropped the frames so it's got to be aware of that uh, and then down in the reflections as well I turn that up to two so if we go to four that didn't really have too much of effect but we still got some flickering going so I'm not too much a little bit better I'm not too sure we'll go unlit to lit I have to play with it a little bit more to uh, get that that out of there for the most part it's it's just beautiful so if we go in the play just basic geometry and some lighting is awesome Go out of there so yeah anyways that's all I wanted to show you I just was making this quick video real quick to just let you guys know that if you you guys want a free scene and you guys want to download uh, UE5 Unreal Engine 5 um, and you want to test it out uh, go ahead and download this scene for free and you guys could uh, test it out. So I appreciate you stopping by. I hope you enjoy the scene. I will see you next time.